Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new Tech Reviews and Gadgets episode where today we're reviewing a 7 port USB hub and you guys are currently watching Curly. today's episode, we're reviewing a 7-port USB 3.0 hub from the company Atola. And this is perfect for people who do a lot of data transfers or basically just want to juice all the products and devices that they have. We're going to talk about a few things on our channel and then we're going to actually get on to actually reviewing this product. So if you guys are new to our YouTube channel, make sure you guys go down below and hit that subscribe button, especially if you're new and also turn on post notifications to stay updated and get updates whenever we do upload to our YouTube channel. If you guys do like this video, make sure you guys go down below and leave a like. That basically informs me if you guys like the video. If you guys have any questions or concerns, make sure you guys go down below and leave a comment. I read every single comment I receive. So if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask away. If you're a business owner or a company owner and actually want to work with us, our business inquiries email is creweliteyt at outlook.com and that's where you guys can shoot me a message and we can potentially work together on a business uh, review. Um, and then also, if you guys want to follow us on social media, our links are down below in the description. You guys can follow us on various social media platforms to stay connected and also have a faster way to communicate towards me. Now we're going to move on to the first look portion and unboxing portion of this video. As you guys can see, this box doesn't really have a whole lot to it. So right here you guys can see it just says Atola, which is obviously the company's name. And then on you know a few of the sides of this box, there's a few specifications which we are gonna take a look at with this secondary camera angle. So you guys can see on the top of the box we have Atola, which is obviously the company's name, like I stated earlier. Right here it says 207, which is the model's name. On the back right here, we have a few specifications and details on this product you guys can take a pause if you want to read that so now we're going to move on to unboxing so what we're going to do is all you have to do is lift this tab up and then kind of lift that up and you guys can see the usb hub lies right inside so you guys can see we have seven ports and each one of them have their own individual power switches meaning that i can turn them on and off at any given time and i forgot to mention that this company did include another usb port so there's technically eight USB ports with this, but this one's solely just to charge devices. So if you have a phone, you can plug your phone in and this will obviously juice up your phone. So what we're gonna do is actually take this outside its box, put that off to the side right here, take the DC cable, and then we also have our user manual. All right guys, so on the screen right now, you guys can actually see all the uh, different things you do get included with this USB hub. Obviously we have our USB hub, um, this does not come with a detachable USB cable. Um, it's actually attached to the USB hub and you know obviously the end where you would actually connect this to your computer or a device that is receiving you know all the data from the things you plug into the hub. Um, it is, it is uh, USB 3.0 meaning that it is really fast and um, it can transfer a lot of data much more quickly than the traditional USB 2.0. Um, we have the AC or the DC adapter um, that you would need to plug in to actually give juice to this hub. And then right here we also have our user guide. So if you guys have any like you know need any assistance with using this, um, you'll read this uh, user guide and it should give you more info. This is all you get included with this USB hub. Now we're going to move on to the testing and demonstration portion of this video. All right, so now we're going to actually test this USB hub out. So what we're going to do is take the DC adapter, which we have right here, and basically untie it. Okay, now that I untied the DC cable, what we're going to do is actually plug it into the wall behind me. All right, so I plugged the cable into the uh, power source, which is the wall behind me. I plugged the DC cable in, and now we're going to plug this USB hub into, uh, not the USB hub, we're going to plug this AC, uh, DC adapter into the USB hub. So right here, there is a DC uh, 5 volt uh, port, and all you have to do is plug it in, and boom. 
you guys can see that the USB hub is lighting up. Basically, what all you have to do now is whatever device you're gonna connect this USB hub um, to, what you gotta do is plug it with the USB cable. So right now you guys can see this is lighting up, meaning that the PAL is actually going through this USB hub. Meaning that anything I plug into it should in theory, you know, start transferring the data or if I plug it into the charging port that I showed you guys earlier, it should start charging my phone. And we're all gonna test this out, so don't worry about that. Um, let me just plug it into my computer and show you guys um, it in function. So we're gonna start off with uh, simple, simple items. Um, I have this USB flash drive. Um, it has a few files on it. You know, we're gonna plug it in. Synced up to my computer, you guys hold the dun dun dun, which is basically meaning that it is connected to my computer. You guys saw that it was flashing, so it connected successfully with no issues at all. Um, my next item is a hard drive, and this hard drive has a lot of our files and YouTube videos on it. We're going to plug this into the USB hub now. Let's do number three. So it works perfectly fine. Um, I do have another hard drive I want to test. So let's say I have all these hard drives and uh, storage devices that I want to basically plug into this and you know, uh, data sync to my computer. Let's plug it right here. Works perfectly fine. Um, you know, the computer was able to recognize the device. Um, it was able to sync up with my computer pretty quickly because remember, it's a USB 3.0, meaning that when I transfer data with this cable, it should be pretty, pretty fast. Um, what was I going to do? I do have uh, one more thing I do want to show you guys. I have this uh, USB uh, cable to charge, you know, like your phones and stuff. Um, let's try it with this um, charging port underneath right here. Um, this is solely for just charging purposes. In fact, it says charging right there, so we're going to plug it in and then we're just going to see if our phone will charge. So I plugged it in on the end. Now we're going to take our phone. So you guys just take a look right here once I connect this. And you guys can see it says it is charging. So this uh, seven port USB hub is doing a fantastic job of transferring data and also charging up my devices. And I really, really think that this is a very practical uh, product to actually consider getting. And it's also very convenient and very portable, especially if you do a lot of data transfers, because I do a lot of data transfers. Different devices and drives are showing up on my laptop. So like the USB hub, I'm not USB hub, but like, you know, the two hard drives, I see them all Western Digital and then the Toshiba one, I see it here. And then I also see the Lexar, you know, USB, um, what is it called? USB flash drive right here. So everything's loading in perfectly fine. Um, right now, we're going to move on to the final reflections and remarks and then end off this video. So what are my final opinions and remarks of this 7-port uh, USB 3.0 hub from the company Atola? I think that this is a fantastic USB hub. I've actually reviewed another USB hub from a different company and I got to say that this one is far better than the one I reviewed. Um, this one it it's so quick the inst like it was so instant um hey, let me actually turn on my computer's volume um it was so instant that once i connected all those devices onto this usb hub it my computer was able to recognize it as if i plugged it directly to the computer which was really nice um i did forget to show you guys one thing if you guys do want to power individual slots all you got to do is hold down the power button and the light will turn off and meaning that that port is not in use so, you know, you can save PAL, you can also, you know, direct your PAL to the ports that are in use. So you can, you know, kind of switch back and forth and I do appreciate them actually doing that. I would recommend this to people typically, like I said, who do a lot of data transfers. Um, people who move a lot of stuff between multiple drives and USB uh, drives and USB flash drives because, you know, you can it's kind of like a control panel in a way, you know, the fact that I'm also able to kind of switch on and off what drives I can use at a certain time 
is really really convenient because what if I have a drive that I don't want to use but I have one that I want to use but I don't want to disconnect it because I'm going to use it later on so it's, it, you know the fact that they implemented that I do appreciate them doing that and I, I do forgot to mention one thing I really like the minimalistic look and build but yeah, I do think that this is a fantastic product. Like that, like I said, this is from the company Atola, and this is a seven-port uh, USB 3.0 hub, and you know you can charge your devices and transfer a lot, a lot of data with this hub. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this v uh, review nonetheless. If you guys are new to our YouTube channel, make sure you guys go down below and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications to get updates and alerts whenever we do upload onto this channel. If you guys have any questions or concerns, make sure you go down below and leave a comment. I read every single co uh, comment I receive, so if you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask. If you're a business owner or a company owner and actually want to work with me, our business inquiries email is creweliteyt at outlook.com and that's where you guys can send me a message and we can potentially work to go on a product review. If you guys want to follow us on social media, our social media links are always down below in the description. You guys can follow us on our various social media platforms or you guys can follow us with the annotations that have been showing across this video. But anyways, I do think that this is a fantastic product from the company Atola. Um, they do a lot of PAL uh, hubs, uh, they do a bunch of, I'm pretty sure they even sell PAL hubs and not PAL hubs but like PAL banks and they do a bunch of PAL related stuff so if you guys are looking into like hubs or like you know different ways you can save PAL or kind of console PAL and stuff I do recommend you guys checking out this company. But anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video regardless and I'll see you guys all on the next one. Freely signing out. Thank you all for watching and have a good rest of your day.